Marion, it's great to come and talk to you about bioidentical hormone therapy. It's been hugely successful for me as a patient of yours. That's how we met. And I've been on an evangelical mission to get as many women onto it as possible. Oh, yeah. So I want to talk to you about this. And I want to know about this as your mission, you know, your mission to transform women's lives. It's absolutely my mission. I mean, it's not only to transform women's life, but actually to tra transform their lives because I want to empower them. You know, I've seen for much too long a time how women have suffered um, and have not known where where to go and and not being given an option and 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 especially hormones because they are you know so essentially important for us yeah, um, it's it's just been so important that women know that they have a safe a safe alternative and that they have options and it is absolutely my mission because I've had too many patients saying you know you've changed my life I've got my life back, I, you know, I've got my family back. And, um, and it, it's a mission because I think it's all women should know about it and definitely all doctors should even know more about it. Marion, you've been a doctor for nearly 40 years. Don't remind me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. And you train in Germany, you've practiced in Australia, you're here in the UK. And this is where you've opened your clinic, the Marion Gook Clinic, which is specifically to use bioidentical hormone therapy for women and for men. So how did you discover bioidentical hormone therapy? What was the moment when you thought this is where I, I will now dedicate my life? Well, I, I actually realized um, how important hormones per se were. It was in, in the early 90s when lots of women were coming to me and they wanted to get off their hormone replacement therapy. Just basic HRT? basic HRT. They wanted to get off their HRT because they didn't feel right, they were putting on weight, they, you know, and they were also a little bit scared about the cancer scare and mm. they, it didn't seem right for women. So I was looking for alternatives. I, uh, at that time I was menopausal and I didn't really know what, what, what it felt like to be so. So I was looking for alternatives. Being an alternative medical practitioner, I, I, you know, I started prescribing um, supplements, vitamins, nutritional, lifestyle changes, and you know, try working with w working with these women who were really very keen to get off their HRT. Mm. And something very strange happened. Um, there was one group of women who um, who managed to go off their HRT. They took supplements. They took vitamins. They uh, they you know changed their lifestyle. And there was another group of women who just, their symptoms continued when they stopped their HRT, but they sort of grit their teeth and said, this is, I don't want to be on the hormones, I just have to bear with it. And there was a third group, and that was a group that really, in many ways, fascinated me because they came and said, my quality of life is just not worth it. I can't be without the hormones, I can't function, I can't work, I can't maintain a marriage, a relationship my quality of life isn't worth it, I don't feel like myself, I'm going to stay on it. And when I realized how there was, and this was a very large group of women, although they didn't want to be on hormones, mm. they decided to be so because of the quality of life. So it was a horrible choice. It was, it was not the choice they wanted, but mm. they'd had no, they, they, they had, no there was no alternative, yeah. they had no other choice. And I was very lucky at that time in Australia, I was working next to a, a, a pharmacist, and, and his assistant basically came, came in and, and to, um, told me what he was doing. He wanted me to know what he was doing. He had been to America and he had started compounding bioidentical hormones basically for his sister and his sister-in-law. Mm. And, and I, I didn't know what bioidentical hormones were. And, and I visited him and, and suddenly made a lot of common sense because he said he was getting such good effects. And what he, was comp what he was making, he was using hormones which were identical to the hormones we produce. Totally, totally identical. And then I thought, well, obviously if we need hormones, mm. it makes total common sense to use the hormones which are identical to our own. Why are we supplementing hormones with with um, something totally else. And I remember, because I could never tolerate the oral contraceptive pill, I felt unwell and I got lots of headaches. And it was the same reason with 
H 